Hi, my name is Lila Ash. I'm an illustrator and cartoonist based in Los Angeles. Uh, most people know my work from the New Yorker magazine. This video will offer a little bit of insight um, on how I figure out my coloring and textures for my cartoons. Um, in this moment, I'm just kind of going in and laying in the basic um, foreground colors for the main characters. Um, I also had a lot of fun with Fresco's uh, halftone options, which is not something that I was used to with Photoshop. Um, so you can see here, I was kind of going a little bit crazy with that. Um, I have a separate layer where I keep a gray tone so that I can easily see um, where my colors are kind of bleeding out. I do a lot of um, really nitpicky kind of coloring in, which is probably, there's probably like a bunch of different ways to color your um, images, but this is just the way I like to work. Um, I find it kind of, you know, meditative and it's just nice. Um, it's a nice way to kind of appreciate the act of drawing. Um, in this section, I'm going in and adding some simple uh, shading. Uh, it often doesn't necessarily make sense with lighting, um, but I just kind of go with the flow and do what I think looks good. Um, I have a multi, I, I put all my shading layers on uh, multiply blend mode, um, which is really nice. And um, throughout this video, you'll see uh, I turn off different um, layers and I have a uh, another blending mode and hue with a black uh, fill, which allows me to see all the colors in um, the uh, gray tones, which helps me decide uh, which colors I want to go with as far as um, contrast goes, which is very helpful. That's how I color most of my New Yorker cartoons which is kind of interesting they all just end up being black and white but I find that uh, coloring them with actual colors helps me kind of get the most rich uh, variety of gray tones um, this cartoon has a ton of detail um, I try to have as much detail as possible because I think it's a fun way to tell stories um, and it's just fun to draw I love drawing so um, there's all these different little elements in this cartoon that were really fun for me to go back in and um, kind of tell a story like this lady with her purple dress like wherever she's going she's definitely like you know working woman or whatever um, so yeah I mean there's this video just kind of is really displays how nitpicky I can be um, I had a lot of fun working with Fresco. Um, it was great to just sit on my bed and work on my iPad, which I'm not used to. Um, uh, you can also see here, I kind of spent a lot of time trying to figure out the best way to deal with the background. Um, in the end, I, added, uh, I ended up bringing in a stock photo of a brick wall from Adobe Stock that I had in my library, and I easily just kind of put it in there. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much uh, how I, this cartoon came to be. Um, thank you so much for checking this out.